We start with the profile settings. They are a little bit hidden behind this profile icon on the top to the right of the main menu. Click on it and then on profile settings and then a rather inconspicuous little window will open with very important settings that lots of users actually search for. To change your user preferences, click on this little pencil symbol and now let's quickly go through the single settings. The first one is the SAC tool language. Here English is activated as a default. The second one is very important. It's called the data access language. So if you use a live connection, for example, with SAP HANA or SAP BW, and perhaps you have stored your data in different languages, here you can change the display language. This is especially important if you have international customers. For example, if you have dashboard users in Spain, and also stored your data in Spanish, those users can select Spanish here as access language. After that, we have some date and time formattings. Here you can change how dates are formatted. For example, we in Germany use day, month and year, whereas in the United States we would use month, day and year. You can also change the decimal separators from dot to comma or vice versa. Some scale formattings, the currency display positions and so on. And there are also some notification settings whether you want to have information about products and learnings. If you want to become the SAC expert in your team, then please check out my SAC masterclass on Udemy. Follow the link in the description and thanks for watching this video.